talking so much a car <laughs> good morning good afternoon good evening depending on where you are welcome to now you know tv on this channel we take you out of what is ordinary and bring you to facts and logic today we're going to make something just local something just kenyan <laughs> yeah so have you ever found yourself with flour the maize flour but and you want to make porridge maybe let's say you don't have uh, the other types of uh, uh, porridge flour now you only have the maize flour so you want to make sweet porridge maybe for your kids for your family what are you going to do to, to make it more sweet tasty yeah so today we're going to use this one as the main ingredient the maize flour and then we have our milk here milk 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 we have our blue bands and then we have our sugar here so just simple ingredients wheat flour milk and blue band and we are going now to make our porridge yeah kenyeji porridge we also are going to use the local jiko to make the kenyeji porridge african kenyan porridge welcome welcome don't forget to subscribe to like comment and also share the video so karibu let us now prepare everything we make together and our morning can start this is uh, almost uh, 10 10 a.m in the morning that's when we are about now to take our breakfast and today we are going to have our kenyan porridge karibu karibu sana so the next thing now I have now to add flour, the maize flour, into cold water. This for real, my pot has some cold water. So I add the mixture of it. So I put some, I don't put a lot of wheat, uh, of uh, maize flour. It gets a lot, as in, it only needs small quantities. Then the next would be milk. Yeah. And every ingredient I said, you must dance. Yeah. So you see. Did you know that you can uh, nani you can uh, nani your milk with just hands? <laughs> Sorry, I didn't have scissors nearby, so I just said, okay, let me just use my hands, yeah. And then I said, okay, let me now take the knife, try to open, yeah, because I didn't have scissors at the moment. Yeah, so there we go. So I'm adding now milk into the water mixed with maize flour so that is what i'm doing right now i uh, i had a one 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 packet of milk so depending on how you love milk you can put two you can put three packets depending on the quantity of also the uji that you are making so in kenya we call porridge uji yeah so that's what we usually make for kids and also for adults if you want to have strong bones then now it's cha one thing with the porridge that I realized, I came to know, you need to whisk, use a whisk for it to, be, to come smoothly. You don't need to have matonge matonge. Yeah. So let me add some more flour. I'm seeing that the milk and water is a lot. So let me add, as you can see. And I'm using taifa. Taifa, I love you people. Yeah. So you need to come and see me. <laughs> yeah. So some of you might be asking, is this a cooking channel? What is it? Why are you doing this? This is now you know TV. I always, I'm always here to teach you what is new. As the name suggests, you didn't know that you can use the Kenyan flour, the maize flour to make porridge. But how does it also me, um, uh, how is it that it can be sweet? Because we are all used to other types of flour to make porridge. So there is where we use milk and and uh blue band now you know yeah then you add also some sugar but now sugar i'll add it when i'm cooking i'm preparing yes so today we are using a charcoal jiko guys that's the typical african way the way we cook as africans huh? yeah the kenyan cooking way so do not have just a unga wapo if you are seeing you know, like i don't have porridge or uh, porridge flour to cook for my kids no you can just use the normal normal maize flour yeah and make it sweet sweeter and sweetest so now the water has to boil reach the boiling point as you can see 
boil 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 then now add some flour kenyan flour the maize flour that's i don't know why i love calling it kenyan flour but yeah it is kenyan what is your problem yeah <laughs> so i stir stir remember the water is hot it's boiled but now the mixture is cold i mix it with cold water always stir with a whisk but see the whisk i'm using the metal whisk not just any whisk yeah so there i whisk 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 can you say whisk five times whisk 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 sijenga juma yeah sijenga ni juma means eh english eh eh sijenga ah i don't know <laughs> yeah i don't want to bite myself mm. you see then i added more water because uh the nani became thick i uh, one thing with maize flour it becomes thick so fast yeah there you go there you go girl yeah so we star 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 oops there is me in yellow yellow yeah so we are using the african charcoal jiko yeah the one that has the mashi ma mash oh today words are going out of me so that is now blue band i use some blue band blibi yeah i add some blue band blue band is very good for for the health of the bones the skin and energy so that's why i prefer to add some blue bands now you know i don't love using a lot of blue band because it it kind of becomes so sweet to manage so i start again star 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 yeah we we zungusha mama zungusha then now i add some sugar we call it sugar <laughs> so then i add some sugar can you say sugar class yeah zungusha mkono zungusha mkono mama zungusha Woo, welo 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 <laughs> welo welo <laughs> ya kisumu changa yeah so shout out to obina tv he does and also a lot of nice work and i love his songs also yeah so that is our kenyan porridge yes using the charcoal stove and uh that is ours it's all because we are putting some wire but don't worry that's what we have for now and that's what we are using as long as it's cooking yeah yeah and now my porridge is boiling 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 so you have to wait for it to really really boil yeah because i didn't have a lot of charcoal in the jiko so it took time yeah it took time to boil but now there it is ready 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 so don't worry i'm using one hand with the camera and one hand with the uji so that's why it's pouring all over but i'll clean the glasses normally if you're using two hands it's, it's so don't judge me shoo <laughs> yeah it's because one hand i'm holding my phone and the other and i'm holding the spoon so that's why i'm messing around but that's the uji see the smoothness see the softness Ooh. yeah and with the guys because i've drank it ah it's so sweet so sweet something that you've never tasted before try try and those who've tried please tell me what kind of sweetness does it bring have you tried this before yeah please guys of south to also support this channel because we do a lot of videos vlogs cooking videos interviews to support please call text or even send some impesa money we'll really appreciate through plus 2549649308 plus 2549649308 anything it's a message it's something you want it's a camera because right now i'm using my phone anything that you want to support me with i'll really from the bottom of my heart i'll really appreciate yeah but don't worry guys even just watching subscribing liking the video sharing that's what is important that's what's up so now i didn't just put like that i had to clean the cups then now save it